Hi guys, so for this video, I'm going to be trying out Phase Martos' joystick device in Arena. Don't worry if you have absolutely no idea what I'm talking about, I'll explain it all later. Just know this device gives you 360 degree movement on keyboard and mouse. It's busted. In fact, I actually have it with me. I'll try to get it in frame. You can see there's the thumbstick, there's a little button attached to it. I can't believe this thing is actually real. In case you're wondering, I got this sent out by Gaming Mod Kits. They're the ones who created it, huge shout out to them. Before before I go and explain how it works though, I kinda wanna go and watch FaZe Martos use it, that'll give you guys a good background, and then I'll go hop in game, get cracked with it, and try to get a win in Arena. I'm not sure if the last part will happen. Regardless, this video is going to be really fun, maybe by the end of it I'll convince myself to switch to it permanently, either way, I think it's about time we head right on into it. Alright, so I kinda switched where my camera was, Martos put a hand cam where my face is, so I had to switch it up. By the way, if you don't know who Martos is, this is his channel. I don't really know what you're doing with your life if you do not binge watch Martos. This man has the best montages. He's also one of the best fighters in Europe. As you can see right here, he fully switched over to this joystick keyboard. This is the same exact device that I have that we're gonna try out. You can see it on your screen. I guess his is white. Oh no, his is black. And it gives him full controller movement on keyboard and mouse. That is ridiculous. It looks like he edits with D. He also has a key bind on A, one on W. He literally literally has the most beautiful broken movement you could possibly get on keyboard and mouse. This is better than double movement keybinds, which by the way, were completely banned. This is straight up 360 controller movement. It's fully omnidirectional. There's nothing you cannot do. Now, the reason I really want to try it out is, as you can see in these clips, his peace control, getting out of fights, just moving around, everything is so clean. And a big reason for that, outside of the fact he has 360 degree movement, is the fact this device opens up four keybinds for you to use that are fully optimal. If you don't understand what that means, look at his hand cam really quickly. He does not have to move any of his fingers off of his keyboard. He can move while he builds, he can move while he edits. This is literally the most optimal keybinds you could get, all because of one device. It's so beautiful! If you kind of think about it, you're basically getting the only thing controller players have, outside of aim assist, over keyboard and mouse players, but you're still on keyboard and mouse, so you can build ridiculously fast, you can edit insanely quickly, you have full range of motion with your movement and with your aim, there's literally nothing that can stop you outside of missing your shots, which Martos does not really do. Oh yeah, and again, this does not give you aim assist, there's a full setting for it that only gives you movement and then lets you use your keyboard and mouse, so no, you're not gonna be cheating, all of this is fully legal, and as you can see, really really good for Fortnite. Let's go and look at it up close. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not really an unboxing because it didn't come in a box. I showed it off at the start, we got a thumbstick. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's also a black key next to the thumbstick. I could press it, it's got a Cherry MX Blue switch. <laughs> And then there's this wire. I guess this wire connects to my PC and it goes next to my keyboard? I'm not really sure. I didn't know this, but apparently this thumbstick clicks in too. Maybe I should use that as some sort of in-game keybind. I asked Martos for his keybind, so I'm kind of going to use his. But most of my building binds are on my mouse and I don't really need to switch too many. It's going to be the smaller binds that are going to be annoying. This is what it looks like up close. It's kind of hard to see since it's all black. Maybe I should have gotten a different color. It's just about the size of my mouse though. It would be much smaller, but it's got this little hump. I assume that's where all the technology technology is. The material is like kind of plasticky. I mean, it's not cheap, but I believe it's been 3D printed. So here's what it looks like attached to my keyboard. All I did was stand my keyboard up and then if I just place it over, you can see it beautifully fits. It looks clean in all black. I'm not going to lie. Only thing is this cable is not too long. <laughs> it ruins my cable management. And basically I kind of just play like this, move it with my thumb. I could go anywhere and and then these will be my build binds, my weapons. I'll also have full use of my mouse. So I'm using this, this, and this. I got three devices going on. This is actually gonna be crazy. I'm either gonna be a complete legend or I'm gonna be a complete bot. Let's go try it in game. Here is the moment of truth. I have just loaded into a game. I am kinda scared to see if it works. Let me move a little bit. Oh my gosh. Oh! <gasps> 
Oh my gosh. Wait, do I even have the setting for it? So I think this is the setting I need to turn on. It already worked. The direction's kind of weird. I think I got to put my keyboard straight because the direction is throwing me off. Let's go for the full 360 degree movement. <gasps> oh, it's so nice. Oh my God. I'm running sideways on keyboard and mouse. The other way is a little more confusing. Oh, there we go. This is insane. I'm on keyboard and mouse and I have 360 degree movement. Oh, it's so nice. I got to change my keybinds though. I messaged Martos and apparently he rests his fingers on Z, S, and C. No longer WASD. That means I'm going to have to unbind my floor, change it to S. Yes, I'm unbinding my movement. I'm going to change roof to Z. That should not be that hard. And finally, building edit to C. I won't change any of the map or the inventory, any weapons yet. I'll leave it and I'll just try to see how this feels. Oh, I keep... Okay, that's awkward. I already pressed W. Build a wall. This is the problem with new keybinds. They are really hard to get used to. And I only changed like three things. I can do anything ramp or wall related. Oh my god, I'm already better than all the kids on the Fortnite subreddit. Your muscle memory is so hard to combat. I'm gonna change back to my kind of old binds where they're in their spot, if that makes sense. Oh, yeah. There we go. Don't even matter, I have 360 degree movement. <gasps> and I have scroll wheel reset! <laughs> I completely forgot I still have scroll wheel reset. Martos is gonna be so good. Would I be the goat if I could triple edit? Oh. <gasps> oh! I'm too good! Could you imagine getting used to this like Martos? I'm so awkward right now and I'm still actually somehow making use of 360 degree movement. I don't quite think I'm ready for arena yet. I'm gonna go into a realistic 1v1. Hopefully this guy does not clap my cheeks. Oh God. I'll play one of these and then we'll go and play arena. Oh gosh, my movement. The fact that this guy's actually good at the game, bro. Oh crap, how do I... Oh, 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 I don't know how to get my minis. 360 degree movement. Don't fail me now. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> the fact you're losing to me right now. I don't even know how to reload my weapon. Ooh, I'm kind of clean though. Wait, how do I reload? Wait, no! Oh my gosh, I'm so good! I'm not really that good. If I completely switched binds and actually mastered these and I did not not know how to reload, like I can't jump. Oh, it's so annoying. Okay, I just got dumped on. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh. Oh. Maybe this wasn't that good of an idea. Don't worry though, I think I can win an arena because I have not played at all. I'm literally at zero points. I don't think you guys can see it. I've been spending way too much time making videos. We are still gonna be playing arena though. New season, it does not matter. We're going back to risky. I haven't even landed there yet. All of it is unmarked. Oh, wait, how do I go down? Oh, that was a little embarrassing. <laughs> that dude wasn't that bad either. I'm telling you guys, if I switch to this, I would actually be the goat. It would just take so long to because I do not have a lot of time while making videos. Feels bad, man. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Let's go. This dragon shotgun is kind of cracked. It does so much damage now. They buffed it the other day. No way you stole the kill. Yes. Oh my gosh. No way do I win my first game, even though it's on zero arena points, with this device. Have you guys noticed that the hand cam has slowly moved forward? I've been pushing the keyboard up because the joystick is kind of stiff. I'm 95% sure this dude is in this garbage can. Why? Oh, he just came out. He just died. It's a 1v1. Wait, oh, rifted. He keeps rifting. <laughs> Let's go! He couldn't handle the 360 degree movement. I'm so cracked! Overall, guys, that is the joystick keyboard that FaZe Martos has fully switched over to. I'm not sure if I'm going to switch over to it myself. I'm kind of not good enough and don't play enough time to get good on it. Let me know down below if I should. On top of that, if you enjoyed the video, do be sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel somewhere down here, and to turn on my post notifications. Shout out to everyone on the screen for using code Jerry, and you guys know I appreciate you guys so much. I'm still going through DMs and seeing who used my code, so don't worry, I'll get to you. Just let me know you used my code, and I will shout you out. Otherwise, that's it for me, and I will see you guys in the next one. Later!